Okay, a little bit more on foundations and we'll be done. When you walk around the house, it's very tempting to look at their AC and that's very important. Look at their seat, their shrubs, um, to look at the windows and the uh, condition of the windows. I would encourage you to pay attention to the foundation itself. So right now what you're seeing is the top part of the slab. So majority of the slab is under the ground, but you're seeing top part of the slab. If it's visible to you, pay close attention and see if you can spot any cracks in the slab even if you see no other signs of foundation repair or brick problems you can sometimes spot cracks in a slab as for example in this case so as you can see there are two par parallel cracks right here and also they're leading to this window right here so it's all kind of ties together let's keep walking We see one more crack. Another crack. Hello. Hi. One small crack. All right, that's it for now. Okay, so uh, with the close observation, we can sometimes notice visible signs of foundation cracking again should does it mean that we should not buy the house not necessarily based on everything that i observe the foundation has been repaired this pile of dirt indicates installation of the piers another thing that indicates installation of the piers are these concrete breakouts right here so remember on the front patio on the front porch we observed another sign of a concrete being poured in fresh concrete so those called concrete breakouts done during foundation repair. So my conclusion about this home, it had severe foundation issues before. The current owners have put in a lot of work to level the foundation. Whether or not to buy this house depends on other variables, whether or not the house is in your price range, right neighborhood, if you like the rest of the house. But from a standpoint of a foundation, do not let the foundation in this case to stop you from purchasing the house because you're going to get a foundation warranty yes